story of John Rolf Madsen is the story of the journey, the romance of the road, finding the beloved places, and is the story of the characters and friends he has met along the way. For John, the early days of the journey include places like High Point, Guam, and Little Rock. It involves soccer teams coached by his dad, misadventures in high school, a state championship in pole vault, and a near miss in soccer, and the coveted title of High Point Central's Mr. Vice. After four great years at UNC Chapel Hill, his journey took him far afield from High Point to places like Argentina to undercut the national telecommunications monopoly, Los Angeles to ride the bubble of a tech startup, San Antonio to do business with Brother Stephen, Hong Kong to tend his server farm, Raleigh to return to his Tar Heel roots, back to Los Angeles and the prelude to this weekend, and whenever he could, back to Silver Valley, North Carolina, and the Bahamas. Introducing John Matson. Back to Chapel Hill. For most of us, we pick up the journey in that storied place where locations like McCorkle and Polk Place, Old East, Laurel Ridge and Millette Street, Airing House and Hooker Fields with a backdrop for John's studies in economics and Spanish, his long tries from the wing and matador tackles for the UNC Rugby Club, and new friendships in Old East, basketball at 39C, and REM Fridays at 110A. Chapel Hill is also where John first meets many of the key characters on his journey. Some of them gather here today. These are friends who have helped shape who he is today and who have been shaped by their now quarter century friendship with John. And just like John's journey, these people too are now spread across the map. High Point and longtime friend Scott Hyatt. John, from our days at Northwood Elementary in Westchester Key Apartments to our days at High Point Central High and North Carolina University, you've always been a great friend. And I know you'll be a great friend and a great husband to Cynthia. Good luck to you. Hillsboro and fellow Laurel Ridge and Millette Street roommate Brian Wren and Son Jackson. John, greetings from the heart of Chapel Hill in a place where we spent a little bit of our time back in the day. Congratulations on the big day. Congratulations, John and Cynthia. Rose goes in the front, big guy. Congratulations, Mr. Bison. Raleigh and the Buxton family, including Hunter, Drake, Luke, and goddaughter Sadie. Years ago, John Madsen came to one of Sadie's productions, and my niece Harper was there as well, and she was a little bitty at the time. And afterwards, I introduced him, and I said, Harper, this is John Madsen, Sadie's godfather. And she got real wide-eyed, and she looked at John and said, are you her fairy godfather? <laughs> And John didn't miss a beat. He said, why, yes, I am. And you know what? He really has been. Because John has a very special way of spreading magic wherever he goes. And Cynthia, you are one lucky woman to have some John Madsen magic in your life. And I just hope that the two of you will see fit to move back to Raleigh where you belong. Because we sure would like to have you over for Sunday supper. Congratulations, guys. Hey John Madsen, congratulations on finally getting married. You certainly held out a very long time for the right person. Um, it's been great having you around Raleigh all these years for Sunday night dinners and coming to all of our games. Even when you take a giant selfie stick to take a picture with at the game and embarrass all of us. But nevertheless, it's been amazing to have you around and we'll definitely miss you. Bucks and kids, wish we could be there. Um, sending you lots of love. John Madsen, what is up? Congrats on getting married. There was one point in my life where I thought I was going to find love before you, but you beat me to it, so congrats on winning that battle. My favorite thing about you is whether playing driveway basketball or soccer in the side yard, you could be dripping in sweat, you could be injured, hurt, but you're still going to go at it. You're still going to try to knock me down. You have that never quit attitude, and I guess it applied to your love life as well. So congrats again on getting married to you and Cynthia, and I wish you the best of luck. Peace out. Congratulations to, hands down, one of my favorite people on this earth. Um, John Matson. you live your life to the fullest. Your fashion sense is a great example. I mean, I look forward to seeing your hat choice, your 
bold color combination, whatever your beard is doing, it's just, I respect it. I mean, the ties, the pink ties I've been hearing about for the groomsmen, bold choice. I respect it, but I really just um, love the way you live your life. I love your perspective on things, your attitude on things, and I miss having it around and hearing it every Sunday. So I know California is great, but so is Raleigh. Cynthia is a very lucky woman, and I miss you, and I love you. Congratulations. The Washington, D.C. area and fellow teammate, Tim Igor Gardner. Johnny L.A., first, congratulations to you and your lovely bride. First, to that epic try you scored against Loyola. Set up by who? Igor. And that epic night we had while living in LA, where we stopped at that bar coming home from Rick's Cafe. Johnny LA, you earned it. And remember, don't have too much fun, or you might end up with three little ones. Hillsboro and fellow rugby teammate Dan Dunn. And action, take 54. Madsen, this is Dan. Congratulations on your wedding day. Cannot wait to celebrate with you. Hopefully it doesn't rain like uh, it's raining right now. Um, see you soon. Congratulations. Yes, nailed it. Chapel Hill and rugby teammate Ted Calhoun. I've seen you grow from a little spry thing, running the fastest try I've ever seen. Now I'm going to watch you grow in your love for your baby. Good luck, my man. New York and fellow Pika Chase Hemphill. Do you guys recognize anything about what I'm wearing? Luke, Jean, Jean Metzen. That's right, High Point, independent soccer movie. One of the greatest uh, testaments to John's character. First man in, last man out when it came to helping me produce this movie. I will never forget your support, your belief. Uh, I love you, man. Always have, always will. Congratulations, I'm so excited for you. I wish I could be there. I'm so bummed that I can't. Uh, but I, you know, I'm excited for you. It's gonna be a great weekend. And I can't wait to see you, to hear all the news and, and you know, to celebrate with you and, and Cindy. Love you. Take care, man. Charleston, South Carolina, and rugby teammate and road trip car mate, Patrick Emerson. Hello, Mr. and the future Mrs. Madsen. This is Patrick and Ann Emerson. Hey. Hailing you from our natural environment, the beach. <laughs> well, we decided to celebrate in the only way we know how. And so we sent a little video for you with my father's Royal Naval Sword in action. Ready? Yeah! Woo! Woo! He was <laughs> the Royal Navy. Chicago and Millette Street roommate Larry Mann. Okay, it's 1990. 1990. Oh my god. Hey, buddy! Yep, that's him. Johnny Matson. Come to the Pi Kappa Phi House. JB and some other rugby players are like, who is this guy? Wait a minute, he's from High Point? I'm from Greensboro. I don't know this guy. High Point, Greensboro, it's the same town. Johnny Madsen, soccer player, High Point. How do I not know him? Anyway, became good friends. And did we have laughs? 110A, 110A, Millette Street. What a spot. And then post college, well, what, what is it that you did in Hong Kong? You said you ran, you were in the phone business? I don't know. My people tend to think that that's just a scam for something else. Anyway, fast forward to today. So happy for you, Johnny Mad. Congrats. You are the man. Miami and rugby teammate and Argentine compatriot Francisco Salonia. Hey Johnny, lots of past since we played rugby together. Um, been uh, to Argentina, crashed at my parents' place. Been to Hong Kong, California, met in Italy with me. Just wanted to wish you the best to you and Cynthia in this new phase. All the best. Abrazo. Ciao. Mill Valley, California and rugby teammates Nick Eaton and Jeremy Kelly. Yo, yo, Johnny Mad, Mr. Green here, aka backup singer for Rain. Just wanted to wish you well on the impending marriage and give you a little ditty. 
To all the girls John's loved before who traveled in and out his dawn. We're glad they came along. We dedicate this song to all the girls John's loved before. Cynthia, you're a lucky lady. Hearts are breaking the world over, man. Enjoy, enjoy the big Johnny, Johnny Mad. Love you. As your navigational officer on that historic trip, I uh, just wanted to say congratulations for making it through and many congratulations on getting married. I couldn't be more delighted for you. Love you, John. Bye. Jackson Hole and fellow oldies sweet mate and road trip car mate, Tom Chapman. Cynthia and John, congratulations from beautiful Wyoming. John, you remember that peak prospectors? Thank God JV and I waited for you there at the top. Anyway, do you still hear the footsteps from that peak, John? I know you do. In London, England, and rugby teammate, Tom Silk. Cynthia, as a former rugby teammate of John's, I can confirm he's the definitive team player. Fleet of foot, strong in the tackle, and a great set of hands that'll set you up for future happiness. My one word of warning, Dad. new members of the team may prove a disruptive force but we wish you a happy wedding. Yeah. Happy wedding! Happy wedding! Happy wedding! Happy, happy, happy John and Cynthia! John and Cynthia! John's journey has taken him literally around the world and endeared him to friends that span the globe. And then that journey led him right back to where it all began, High Point, North Carolina. In Jack Kerouac's On the Road, the Bible of our Magenta Road Trip, Sal Paradise says, somewhere along the line, I knew there would be girls, visions, everything. Somewhere along the line, the pearl would be handed to me. And as it was on Sal's journey, so it is on John's. The pearl has finally arrived, and she is from High Point. This large cast of characters, together with many others, are proud to have swum into your ken and been part of your journey. Excited to be witness to this great event, and contented to know that your journey is now a shared journey, and that Cynthia, like you, looks to all the mystery that is to come, y mañana otra cosa, and embraces it. Happy wedding, Madison.